Hey there, this is Dr. Perry with another Make Time Moment. Hey, I had a great time at Thanksgiving and the day after I was able to actually go shooting with my brother-in-law and my father-in-law and we had a great time at an outdoor range at Carter's there in Houston, Texas. Well, the reason I bring this up is not to just brag that I get to go shooting once in a while because it's fun, uh, but I found that I learned a really valuable lesson and that was that oftentimes we set goals the wrong way. Um, I've given five tips about how we set goals the wrong way in a podcast that's coming out here next month. January 1, I'm going to roll out our first podcast on New Year's Day. Yes, New Year's Day. Why? Because goals are oftentimes set the wrong way and I want to be there for you at the beginning of the year as you start to set up your New Year's resolutions and things you want to do different in your business and your personal life. But one thing I will share with you right now, a little teaser before the podcast comes out, one thing that really stood out to me, and that is we oftentimes tend to shoot from the hip, right? I've got a handgun and I can kind of shoot from the hip and that that uh, analogy or that phrase comes from just hurrying up and doing something, right? And just trying to get it done and trying to get to our target or our goal. Well, as I was on the rifle range, I found that uh, my father-in-law's gun, his 30 6 had a really nice scope. And he told me how to line that up just right so that if I was consistent and I was patient and I could shoot that rifle the way I was taught in Boy Scouts with my father, my grandpa, and my Boy Scout leaders, um, that I could actually be really consistent. And so, while I didn't do as well in the handguns and kind of lost the competition to my brother-in-law, when we got to the rifle, he thought he could best me twice. But because I knew exactly how scopes work and how to really narrow in on that target, I was able to uh, you know, do a lot better than he did. I don't want to say a lot better. Sorry, Dave. But I beat him. I did it, I did it better than he did um, on the competition. I beat him fair and square, but it was the scope. It wasn't necessarily myself, not just an amazing shot from a hundred yards away, uh, but we had several bullseyes. I just got more than he did on that paper because I was able to know exactly where that scope is. Well, what does this have to do with goals? Unfortunately, a lot of us tend to shoot from the hip and go straight out to the paper and just bang, bang, bang. Um, and But with rifle, if we have a scope, if we have values, Values represent our, our scope. If we have values, values will line up our goals. Oftentimes, you know, we're really quick to set New Year's resolutions and set goals, but if we don't really understand what our values are and how those really line up with our goals, or if they're not aligned, then our values are actually working against our goals. And subconsciously, we're not really truly wanting those goals to work out because our values aren't aligned. And our subconscious mind actually goes to work against us. But if we can work with our values and align our goals with our values, then our inner desire, our principles, the things that we care about, our guiding you know, values in our life actually work subconsciously on us every day to move us forward. We don't need external rah-rah all the time. I talked about Tony Robbins before. We don't need that every day if we have internal values that will guide us and line up with our goals. Thought I'd share that with you today. I've got several other tips are coming out on why people don't achieve their goals in my very first podcast here at the beginning of the year, the Make Time Podcast. Watch and uh, wait to subscribe to that coming soon. Hope this was helpful. And remember to like and share this and let others know about the content here on travisperry.com. Also, you can go uh, to the uh, masterclass, travisperry.com forward slash masterclass. I'll put that in the links below. Subscribe, like this video, let us know, you know in the comments what other types of videos you would like to know about when it comes to goal setting, time management, and really living your life on purpose. Have a great one, and remember to live your life on purpose.